Uh, yes, it's a typical morning. I'm on Twitter just browsing stuff, minding my own business. I might as well check my timeline to see what people are posting. If you couldn't already tell, I got blocked by Kaneko Kid. Anyways, it's Hazel Luchi back at again with another episode, and today I'm going to be talking about the man, the myth, the hypocrite, the furry, that was definitely stopping my YouTube channel for this video. Okay, so I've been trying this whole write a script thing, and I'm kind of liking it. Anyways, before you say I'm whining about getting blocked, I'm not. And as Kaneko would say, they do not owe you a response. So, I'm not asking for a response. I'm making an educated guess on why I was blocked. Anyways, guys. Can I go get him blocked me? Okay, so if you guys don't already know, this Kaneko kitten is a hypocrite. But you're probably wondering, how do I know this? Well, if you didn't already know, he's kind of like a Twitter social justice warrior. When it comes to stuff like drama, he's the kind of person to say, drama hurts both people to sell it in DMs. He DM'd me about my videos and told me to please not make videos on him. As you can see in our DMs, he says, please stop taking drama that happens to me on Twitter and make it into videos. I do not need people promoting this kind of negativity on YouTube, and there's a good reason why I stay from putting, it, that, putting that stuff on YouTube. It's not content. I really do not appreciate it. But was it really necessary to go beyond saying you need to stop taking drama that happens to me on Twitter and making it into videos? I mean, you didn't have to insult my videos, bro. Even though he insulted my videos, I said, Okay, I deeply respect your opinion, and I will stop making as many videos about your Twitter drama. Well, I was obviously being way more professional than him, but that's not the point. He goes on saying thank you. I thought it was over because, I mean, like, I said before, he's the kind of person to say drama hurts both people to sell it in DMs. I don't know if he just stubbed his toe or something, because two hours later, he publicly calls my videos clickbait. I'll get more to this later on, but he publicly says these videos are clickbait. Nathrix and I are still friends. Lol, you don't need to make videos when I can state this clearly myself to my audience. I see this and I'm very confused because... Like I said before, he's always saying drama hurts both people to sell in DMs. So I reply and say, I find this funny coming from a guy saying solve it in DMs. Then he replies saying, I mean, when you make videos publicly mooching off a of drama that didn't involve you, I'm going to call it out publicly. So basically you say is you should solve it in DMs, except if you're publicly mooching off a of drama that didn't evol involve you. Well... Someone has to tell the public about this. Anyways, I'm glad that this drama currently is involving me so I can make publicly videos mooching off of drama that involves me. Obviously, hypocritical. Well, you might be asking, how do I know he's a social justice warrior? Well, I could have brought up some information about the Nathrix photo controversy and taken an educated guess. But why would I do that when he just tells us? He says, quote unquote, I am definitely a social justice warrior. Maybe he's just being sarcastic, but who cares? He said it. He's one of those people that will get inf offended over small things. Anyways, let's move on. Now your homies are your yes man, egos over the max. Well, here we go, talking about people's egos. I guess you could say this is about to be the largest subject in the case of Kaneko. Well, he says 61 people think I'm a social justice warrior. Wow. Thank you for up, thank you uploader for allowing people to have this false impression over me. Wowie. 66 people? In the case of Kaneko, there are 66 people really that important to you? Oh wait, make that 62, you gotta just like the comment. I mean, he has over 100,000 subs. If I had that many supporters, I would not care if a person with 100 times less subs uploaded a somewhat irrelevant video about me. Or, if, or by 61, I mean 62. He's so insecure. Well, I just explained the news. 
if you can already realize it, Nathrake says that he will do little to no drama videos now, and Kaneko Kitten definitely wouldn't unless he changed his mind like before. Anyways, if no one's covering Twitter drama, people who only have YouTube won't be able to see an unbiased standpoint. So, if I upload it, we'll be on the platform that they use. Also, let's really quickly talk about my videos. They may have been a little clickbait, but it's YouTube. You gotta get your channel known somehow. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, follow me on Twitter, join my Discord and my Roblox group, buy my merch. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and goodbye.